What the hell is this? No, 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 it's a game about an alien invasion. And Honey over here, she's not a fan of aliens. Minus one. <laughs> so you're already at minus one. But hopefully it's a fun game and she will be uh, convinced that it was fun. I'm liking that grass effect, by the way. He loves alien stuff. I do. I'd like to keep this handy for close encounters. I heard that. Yeah, but I don't. I'm a totally opposite. Nah. I'm, I'm about theory. Ooh, I wonder if it's a... F Refugium Games. Oh, you play a, a demo for this game? Mm hmm. Are we playing a demo too? It's the full game. Guys, can you hear me? My husband said he spotted someone or something next to our car again. I know this sounds weird, but he said it looked like an alien. But they ran into the cornfields and disappeared. I'm going to call the police. Amy, don't. I don't trust the cops or the government, or anyone else for that matter. And you shouldn't trust them either. We created our neighborhood watch for this exact reason. Brandon, I understand the situation, but this needs to stop. It's also absolutely irresponsible to send Ryan out tonight. Amy, don't tell the officials anything. Otherwise, we all end up in the nut house. Are you trying to tell them we think there's little green men running around? Gray, Brandon. They are gray. <laughs> the only thing we can do in our situation is to board up our windows and doors. I'll try to rest a bit. Uh, but Amy, trust me. You don't want to end up in the psych ward. I've paid a high price to break free. The only way to escape Bob, was to... you've told your stupid story a thousand times. In Vietnam, we dealt with things worse than that almost every day. What does Vietnam have to do with... Hey! Whatever. I always wear my tinfoil hat when I leave my camper van. I'm offended. I believe the aliens <laughs> have the ability to control us through telepathic powers. I'm convinced. Did <laughs> <laughs> I scare you? <laughs> no, I, I don't know why you're guys, screaming, so I muted it. <laughs> been acting strange since he came home from the forest this morning. Is he in my country? I don't know what's going on with him. Mm -hmm. Ryan! Hey, my kitty cat's also behaving really strangely. And she hasn't come home yet. Please, look for her during your shift. I'm really lonely without her. Oh, so we gotta look for a cat? Uh, Henry is more important right now. But if I find your cat, I'll let you know, Bob. Did we just start? Yes, we did. All right. I'll reach out to the other neighbors. I'll tell them to board up all their stuff. The fact is, our government is hiding something from the people. Things like this just don't happen here in Grey Hill. It started with Roswell, and it's been increasing since the 60s. That is the way it is. Are you and your bat ready for the night shift? Ryan Baker, the king of baseball. Yeah, Brandon. I am. I think I'm Ryan. Don't forget to visit us later, Ryan. We'll make some coffee for you. Hmm. Oh. Yeah. Sure. Okay, I am Ryan. Thanks, Amy. Okay. Playing this game might be interesting. Remember when the, the government, the U.S. government, admitted aliens are real? And nobody seemed to care? <laughs> when? <laughs> exactly. I mean, months ago. It... Didn't seem very believable, but... To me, a game or real life? Real life. Oh, I don't trust them. Well, exactly. Walkie-talkie. The neighborhood is communicating via walkie-talkie most of the time. We'll go, yeah. A hand-crank flashlight? Oh, really? <laughs> Brandon brought several of these flashlights from Vietnam. We're using them because the others have problems at night. I think they work because of the crank function. However, the dynamo doesn't work. 
that sounds smart if if aliens or whatever are like sucking the i don't know electromagnetic field or something that sounds like it would help maybe Ooh, a puzzle mm -hmm. that was 10 years ago still haven't figured it out wow All right, so, so smart ryan wow oh it's may 1992. <laughs> Is there lights? This is dark. I guess I just leave. Hmm. Anything else you can get, honey? <laughs> well... Check the drawers, maybe? Doesn't seem like it. We, oh, we're reading alien books. The Abduction by James Freeman. I bought this book back in the 80s. My brother Bob experienced something similar during his childhood. This is this this is my story. I explain everything about what I experienced during my alien abduction. Hmm. The Bible, super dark. Can't seem to turn any lights on. No, I think we're good to leave. Oh. There's a kid here. Kid, why are we in total darkness? Henry, tell me what you saw in the forest today. You should ask Rachel, that crazy girl. Henry, is someone in your room? Is Rachel in there? What was that noise? Is it fireworks? Stop bothering me. What's going on oh, with you, Henry? <laughs> tell me. Who's there? I'm going to your room, Henry. Stay here. Wow, our son is creepy. Buddy, what? Why don't we turn the lights on? I don't understand. Mm -hmm. It's dark. Maybe for creepy effect. Was that door up here? Or up here? I mean, right here? Yeah, the house is so dark in general. Yeah. Well, it's because the lights are off. Okay, I well, think... They can have, like, warm light on at night. Whose room is this? Someone was in your room. They went out the window. Oh! You can hear footprints, or... Yeah, somebody walking in the grass. Oh, shit. Max is barking! Okay. Fuck this. Should I look out the window? Henry doesn't care. <laughs> You're barking at, boy. Where's my damn flashlight? Did you bring it? In the shack. Max, stop barking. Oh, good boy. Someone in the shed. Max, be quiet. What? something to break this door max what's your name max I need to find something to break the door okay let me go to uh a storage room well it's my first time living here so i don't know where anything is i shouldn't do that now <laughs> Maybe you have to climb up the tree. Tree house. Maybe, yeah. So this is all blocked I don't off. Know. Try everything possible. Oh, that's blocked too because of that. <laughs> oh, it's, it's this crowbar by the light. Wow. You go too fast, I guess. Alright. What's the alien doing? We got it to open a door, Christina. <laughs> Whew. Empty. Oh. What the? No, Max. Is he on the roof? Oh, I'm I'm locked. Where'd you go, boy? That was, that was my dog. Max! Max! In here, 
him anymore. Sounds like the neighbors are boarding up their windows. I guess I should do the same. What? We should all do the same. What about your dog? I hope this is over soon. What the hell was that light? Uh, I guess we're giving up on the dog. All right, where do I get boards from? Dad, it wasn't Rachel, right? Yeah, he uh, locked the door and ran out of the roof. It's okay, he's gone now. But there was a strange light. Look, the TV. It's working now. Oh, it wasn't working because the like, aliens were close? and conspiracy theorists claim to have seen a UFO. The minority tries to convince other people that the small green aliens are real. The government has checked into this incident and has announced that this UFO, fortunately, is just a weather balloon. This movement that you'll see in a few seconds is just a reflection on the lens of the camera. <laughs> there is no reason to concern. And don't forget to be aware of the small green man in your backyard. Your wow. What a condescending news agent. That is not a weather balloon. They're lying. The government is lying and they're trying to hide it from us. Brandon was right. They're already in Grey Hill. We can't talk about it to the police. They'll just lock us up in a psych ward. Dad. We need to get out of this cursed place. I hate this neighborhood hole. Ryan, are you there? I'll go talk to Brandon. Uh, oh, walkie talkie. I'm here. Ryan, something is wrong with Joe Parson, the farmer, you know? called me a few minutes ago. He was very afraid. Then the radio connection became broken off by something. He is working on the field near your house. You must check immediately what happened to him. Okay, I'll go check on him. By the way, someone was in Henry's room. They escaped out the window. I almost caught them in our shed. But there was a strange blue light. I'm sure Pull they're here. together. Have you seen the TV news? No one will help us. We're all boarding up our windows currently. I know how to shoot because of the Vietnam War and you can handle the baseball bat. We will overcome this night and drive to our holiday home by tomorrow. Don't forget how I shot your son's hat off while wearing it when I was drunk at the barbecue last oh, summer. Brandon! Imagine how you I can still handle have the to gun pay when for I'm that. sober. <sighs> but leaving town tomorrow sounds like a good idea. I'll keep you updated. Over and out. Okay. So check what the neighbors are doing, huh? I hear something. Oh, back door. What was my flag waving? Yeah, we got lots more boards. that emergency oh see something right there that full of car run by honey uh -oh. what was that this thing the cow right there oh hello How's it going? Do I take my car, maybe? Mm. Axe? Joe Pearson sold me this axe last year. He said I could chop wood three times faster. I think it was a lie. Am I a midget? 
Oh, this is hiding. Oh. <laughs> I was like, why? Why can't I see past the... Yeah, it doesn't seem like I can go over the fence. Oh, I have to literally click that. Whoa, wait, hang on. Uh oh. Oh. Dead cows. Right? Oh my gosh. Lots so of them. I don't think so. Uh oh. Damn it. It's being interrupted. We're losing a lot of money. They're skinned, I think. Oh, I can hide in here. Like I can, I can get in. Oh, that's what you're supposed to do. Get in and look at his walkie-talkie. Oh my God. Brandon, Brandon, this is Joe. They're trying to break into my tractor. I hope this message gets to you. Walkie-talkie connection broke. They're small and gray. Oh my God. Hey. Oh, they got him? Okay. Yeah, it's our first time being able to, like, I don't know, explore a vehicle. So, I didn't know we could do it. Okay, so they got him. Took him where? Took him hostage. Oh. What's that? Something green. Sprinting honey. <laughs> what is that? Oh, it's a cat. But you've been touched. What the is this Bob's <laughs> cat? What the hell was on her head? I mean, it looks like Kitty. I should bring her to his caravan. Oh, oh so they touch it, it glows? I'm glad it's a docile cat. What do you mean it's virus? What am I supposed to do? Bring the kitty to Bob. His caravan is over there. Oh. <laughs> so I go to look this thing now. All right, Bob. You got your cat. What the? He already boarded up his door weeks ago. I'll have to try the dormer window on his roof. Try his roof. I'm oh, broken. Oh, he's not home, huh? Ooh. Baseball bat, I will need it tonight. Where do I put the cat? Where's Bob? Oh my oh, god. Crack. Oh my oh, god. Crack. I thought that was you and my Gosh, I, I thought Bob is like the old guy. My cat? That's Woody Harrelson, I swear. Yeah, I caught her out in the field near the tractor. Oh, what does she have on her head? I don't know. It makes a strange noise. It sounds like electricity or something. Oh, and Bob, I had a strange encounter in my backyard. There was also some kind of weird electricity. I'll tell you about it later. Let's look at the cat first. On the table. I'll take a closer look. This? Oh, this guy wrote this book. They abducted me. Bob wrote a book about his alien abduction experience. Unfortunately, he can't find a publisher. <laughs> Subwater, directed by Keys Cameron.
tinfoil upgrade. Bob's creation. Aliens can't intercept our walkie-talkie when using it. Okay, where do you... Oh, she's down. Well, okay. I mean, it looks wow, like he's got a ponytail? Some kind of probe. Ryan, I think they abducted Kitty and had experiments. By the way, have you boarded up your house? It's really dangerous in Grey Hill these days. No, not yet. You should do it immediately. You need to wear a tinfoil hat. Your son, Henry, too. They go into your brains by telepathy. Mm -hmm. Also, don't forget, don't ever tell anything to the police. As Brandon said before, the government knows it. Now, take this preparation for your walkie-talkie. The tinfoil's on the kitchen desk. <laughs> Oh. Ryan, please check the monitors. Fast! Huh? What the hell is this? No, 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 It's a literal alien ship. Dude. Oh. They're here. They are here. Henry's a loaded home. I have to go to him now. Yeah. We well, might go home by the streets. This is not a time to have your hands on your hips. I've got a camera. I'm going to record the UFO. This will be the perfect. Break some obstacles. And then I'm coming over. Break down the door with your baseball bat and take care. Break down your door? Wow, man. This guy's dumb. What has he got? Henry, can you hear me? What are they doing to the cows? He's recording them. Oh, okay. Brave. So what do I have to do? Find a safe way to your house. Oh, there's a barn right here. Go up top. Or not. Try that again. Uh, <laughs> awkward. Don't fall, honey. Yes, fall. Oh, die. Oh, a note. Daddy. Alien in cornfield. Saw this yesterday. You must report this to Brandon tomorrow. Farmer's Drawing by Joe Pearson. Alien in the Cornfield. Hmm, he wrote a note to himself. I think he had Alzheimer's. Oh, that's sad. Oh, God. They're outside there. How do I get out of here? Oh. What was that? Shut the door on me? Out of here somewhere. Is that my house right across here? I wish we have a map. <laughs> I'm lost. Lost in a cornfield. Yeah, the blinking lights seem to be a, uh, leading me. I'll go in the cornfield. I think I remember there being a fence through the cornfield. Just 
need to get around the silo over there. Around the silo? Oh, this? Ah, itchy. Ah, scratched my face. Ah! <laughs> yeah. Silo. Uh oh. Take me with you, alien. Hi, Tunny. Oh. They are not hiding at all. What's he doing? Wait, is that my house? Run! No! No! Hang on! Take it, my boy. Not my boy. Well, it looks like he's willing to go, you know. Wow. <laughs> oh, she's. So my dog's gone. My kid's gone. <laughs> Gray invader. Oh my god, that's pretty funny. Cops? Police arrive. Oh! Whoa. I mean, predictably, they got destroyed. Do I check on them? Are you okay? gone there's a top secret note expected alien invasion in gray hill on may 11th 1992 they knew this was happening <gasps> oh gun police car this doesn't make any sense very convenient that the one police car that came happened to have that revolver Ooh. Okay, so we have a gun now. Three. Three shots. Oh boy. Poor cows. Yeah, the cows never did anything wrong. Oh. Huh? Just... Bob, they got Henry. They have ducted him using some sort of ray or beam right through the roof. A squad car crashed back there. I think Amy called him, but the car's empty and the office is gone. Ryan, this is an absolute invasion. Do you know what that means? They'll abduct everyone in the village. Humans, animals, and every little insect. They'll take samples of everything, making experiments of everyone. This is an extraterrestrial investigation. This can't be our end. I don't want to end up as an alien experiment victim. They already cleaned your house, so I don't think they're going to come back. I've already started to board up your place. This will save us tonight. But Ryan, we have a little problem. I used up all the nails. This morning, I brought all my nails to the creek thing. Mr. Creek put them on the table in their house. You have to go get them. It's the first house on the left. Why don't you do it? I think he boarded it all up. All right, I'll but get them. You have to find we a way in. communicate by walkies from now on. Test, test, test. Uh, can you hear me? Hello? Over. Yeah, I can hear you. By the way, I found a gun in that crashed squad car back there. Great. Let's hope I don't Be have to quiet use it. and sneak around. It's dangerous if they hear the shots and see you. Also, avoid using the flashlight. The greys could see it immediately. And take note, it's important that they don't follow you into a house. If they do, we're screwed. If it becomes dangerous, hide in a car, a trash can, or something else. Yeah, great. Trash cans. Hmm. Brandon would love to see that. <laughs> okay. Good luck, Brian. I'm waiting for you. So don't use your flashlight? Mm. Whoa. Let's try to go in. Maybe I don't go in here. Yay. 
This might not be the right house. The first house on the left. It is the left? I'm just checking for something. So first house on the left. I mean, this was the first house we came across, but maybe it's down here. Okay, so we can hide in the cars. Check this out. Fireworks. Oh, it's that thing going off. Electricity. Nope. Oh, all these houses are duds. Dinner? Diner? Oh, is this blocking my path? <laughs> How will I ever get over this? I can't lift my leg up. Maybe this way in the back. Oh yeah, blinking light is always a good sign. So that's where they lead you. Crouch. Oh, it's an alien. Just went in. I wonder if I have to shoot him. Do I like choke him? Okay, I think I avoid him. Flashing light was. It's like in there. Hey, Bob, I got some nails for you. Great, Ryan, you've got them. I've got some ammo. Ryan, take are you there? Brandon, I'm here. Boarding up your house does nothing. Brandon, hang on! I'm coming! Okay, Ryan. Go to Brandon. He needs your help. In the meantime, I'll try to get my caravan working. They disabled all the cars in Grey Hill. Okay. And where the hell does he live? Stay over there, probably. Go to Brandon's house. It's in the Creek's house direction. That's where I just was, I guess? My name's Ryan. Who is this? My name's Apone. Thank God you're here. Uh, I'm injured. I'm trapped in a barn. Jesus, what's that smell? Who are you? In which barn? There's tons of them. Oh, it's gone again. I'm not sure. I just, I just woke up here. I, I can't remember what happened before that. You said your name is Ryan, right? I have to tell you something. The government, they... They know everything. They... They knew the invasion was happening here. Mm. They're gonna cover it up. Like they always have. I'm 
sorry. I, mm. I got here too late. The shit! Listen, Ryan, you have to get as much tinfoil as you can. At least five rolls. Hello? Hello? Uh, I think that was that cop that crashed his car. How does he know all of this? And where the hell am I gonna find all that foil? Hmm. Hmm. So slow. Jeez. I must. I must have to go around. Oh, this just opened now. Uh oh, my flashlight's freaking out. So now we're past that piece of wood that we couldn't step over. Any bullets? Oh yeah. Where would that be? Well, should be in the kitchen. Ah. Come on. Wow, it's just a roll of tin foil for no reason on their desk. Okay. One. Does that mean we have to fight five of them? <laughs> well, it's just probably around. Alright, so. There was only one in that house. Oh, it's an alien right there. Oh. And they seized the flashlight. Hi. Okay, here's another house. There was an alien. Where'd he go? He's looking for you. I see. Was I just in this house? I was. To be honest, I don't know, honey. <laughs> Look alike. One more on the left side. Yeah. Three. Well, so oh my, that's how I find ammo. It's just a single bullet. <laughs> it's just there for no reason. Oh, yeah. I can hide in there. Enough. Heard one of them. Oh, right there. He's scanning something. Oh! Jesus! I didn't even see him, but... Apparently. But open the closet! It's a good thing we played out last first. What?! So the hiding doesn't even I think stop he's him. Late. That's why. Okay, and you got very little time to escape. Okay, next time I just blast them. How about that? At least it's saved here. Okay, next alien who sees me is getting blasted. But I think I don't have a lot of bullets, so I gotta find a better way to get around him. see them so they're not in the same location wait where's the door oh here Many team four? Uh, I think I have four now yeah No bullets. We can hide there. And off the light, honey. If you go out, turn it off. I was trying to... Oh. There he is. Hey, I'll just go around. He's just <laughs> chilling. Oh. 
I wonder if he sees me through windows. Doesn't look like it. Don't be dumb. Close, Wait. honey. Oh, oh. Fuck you, bitch. Ah. Oh, fuck! Shit, give me. Oh, it's just a, a child, this one. Was that your father? <laughs> fuck you both. Don't fuck your whole family. I think they're dead, honey. I mean, I thought that was a, the friend's gonna come. That was a father and son alien just exploring the galaxy. That's what they get. Don't underestimate it. Don't come to America and expect to survive. I should check in on Amy. Open. has to be in the diner. Is this the diner right in front of me? Amy? Where's Amy? She should be here. That's what they get. She's hot on the table. Right? No. Or the dead hoer, no? <laughs> Note? Or or We're in the barn in front of the diner. Oh yeah, I can smack him. I wonder if I can smack the alien. What? Oh, I thought I saw one. Over there? Is that... Crouch. Get in the car. Yeah. So dark. I want to look for bullets, but there's nothing. Oh, I need to go over there. Something happening over there. Maybe alien here. What's happening in there? Uh oh. They're scanning people, honey. The hell were you guys doing? Um, oh, she was fixing it. Ryan, thank God you're here. Are you okay? No. Nothing is okay. <laughs> they abducted Henry. I have to find a way inside that UFO. Meanwhile, I've been trying to get to Brandon's house because he's in trouble too. We'll help you, Ryan. The cars don't drive anymore, but maybe this old biplane does. We could use the biplane to get near the UFO. Wow. That seems like a long shot. She's weirdly calm. But I guess it's our only option. But even if we do get close, how the hell are we going to get inside of that thing? I don't know. Maybe Matt has a solution for that. He is on the farm to get some stuff. Can you tell him that the biplane is almost repaired? All right. And by the way, that officer you called? They got him. They imprisoned him in a barn somewhere around town. I also found some odd documents about Greyhill in a squad car. I never call the police. Brandon forbid that. Oh, he came here by yeah. himself? But I thought you don't listen to our chief. Usually I don't listen to him. This time I did. But who called him then? I don't know. I'll go talk to Matt now. Ryan, we'll find the solution to rescue Henry. Yeah, she's so calm. I think she's more of an alien than the other aliens. But honestly, I, I feel like whoever's girlfriend that got to voice act in this, like if you're directing a game or any kind of any direction, you, you surely would be like, all right, cut, honey. It's a fucking alien invasion. People are being taken. This has never happened before. This is not just an inconvenience. Okay. It's not. It, this is not just Starbucks is closed. It's an alien invasion. Give me some emotion. Oh. The director asked her to do that way. I doubt it. She probably just recorded once and like, that was so great. Man, you're pretty. They're probably just simping or something. Terrible performance. Whoever did this terrible. <laughs> Zero out of 10. I would not hire again. Unless she is an alien. Then it's a 10 out of 10. But I have a feeling you're supposed to be a human. Mm -hmm. Anyway, hopefully I get to shoot her later. <laughs> Why? <laughs> you know, part you of waste me wants to bullet. just test it right now. You waste a bullet. Yeah, true. She is a waste of a bullet, isn't she? Oh, okay. They put fencing here. Talk to Amy. Again? What do I t talk to her? Do I use a walkie-talkie? Well, a walkie, yeah. 
early. What did I miss here, Amy? She's like, mm, get out. Well, apparently she was just fixing this thing. I need to tell someone about this plane. All right, Amy. You're getting... You're getting real close to uh, the end of the line. <laughs> oh, was I supposed to just go around like this? Oh my god, I was. Bro. That's what they wanted you to see. That dark corner would be like, yeah, just go around the plane. Really? This is not clear. And then this just opens. Is that you? Was that supposed to be spooky? And then it magically closes. Okay. We'll find our son. I took our son, honey. Gotta keep an eye out for. Oh. I need to find a key. Oh, really? Is there a key here? It's really dark, this game. Yeah, one thing that's always weird is figuring out where this game wants you to go. <laughs> Maybe over to this house? I think it would be oh. great if they give you a, like a map. Oh, but... is that an alien? It is, right? Mm. Okay, it is. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Get away from me, you bitch. Now I have more. I think more is coming. Right? How did he see me? Did you drop anything, you little disgust bag? Ah! Oh, shit. <laughs> Dust bag? Ah! Oh. Ah! Oh. Shit. <laughs> Can I run? To hide. I'm looking. Anywhere to hide? Man. Why did we go this way? Okay, oh, I can hide in trash cans. Too, too close to them. You can clearly hear him. Close the door. <gasps> oh, shit. What do I spam? Fuck. Yeah, it's, when you change the like, controls, it doesn't update Jump it on the it. screen. Err. I think there's a house here. Let's go check this house, I guess. Can I go up there? Lar. What's in here? Yeah, they seem to have. Sometimes they have items, they have guns or something, shells. But this one has nothing. Excellent. Nice house. What is that certificate? 1969 Grey Hill biplane racing winner. Oh. Now, what is my objective? <laughs> Let's go. Wandering. So we went past her barn. Mm. Oh, we gotta tell oh, someone. Oh, there's a key in this truck. Grab it, you. We gotta tell someone that the the plane is ready, right, to take off. Well, right? no, I found a key. There's a room here that needed a key. I know, but uh, you were... I don't know, man. man. This game has a really bad direction. Okay, now I open this. What's up? Hello? Hello? Help, I'm, I'm locked in here! Matt? Matt! What are you doing in there? That can't be my son. We watched him get abducted. What if it's the uh, mimic? Aliens came and I... I hid in the oh. safe, and, and now I'm... I don't think that's my I'm son. Someone else. Oh, shit. Okay, um... I don't know the code, but I'll look for it, so just hang on. Wait, 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 wait. 
Ah. Brian, you don't think that they, um, you know, probe us when we become what? abducted? I don't know, man. They abducted Henry. Try not to think about that Henry, right now. Henry, that's my son. Just hang on and let me get you out of there. Oh, Ryan. We'll help you. Please. Please look for the public. My back hurts already. But make sure the greys don't follow you into this room. Otherwise, you have to lure them away. He's okay. so suspicious. <laughs> I think he's just a weirdo. So it seems like items are sometimes in things, like a truck or whatever. Gotta find the code. How many digits or no hints at all? Well, I don't think it's in here. Find the safe code. Worst flashlight in all of existence here. Mm -hmm. And no hint at all. Like, where would it be? Zero four. <laughs> the channel. Where on earth would this code be? That's, what it, that's one thing this game is absolutely piss poor at is <laughs> any kind of proper direction. Find the code with no semblance of where it could be. Like, you think I somewhere in the house, perhaps? But no, I didn't see anything. Maybe Goldier flashed? Flashing? That's where we came from there. There's a truck. This is where we got the key. Look around for anything. Nothing. Check this other house. Okay, maybe that certificate is the answer. I don't know. 1969? Oh, yeah, it says that could be the right number. Let's try 1969. There you go. Oh, it's in a different house. <laughs> Which makes no sense. Unless this guy owns both houses. He's sure. rich. Shut the doors. Alright, butthole. Whoa! Hey, man. Okay. All right. I'm gonna go talk to Amy about our plan to rescue your son. Can you go and search for a barrel of kerosene and bring it to the barn gate? Yeah, I'll go find one. You just better have that plane ready. Find some kerosene. Again, with no idea. Just go find it. Can Not I like something? what. He looks so small compared to that safe. <laughs> he, I mean, he was crouching. And no direction whatsoever. Go to the neighbor's house somewhere around there. You know, some kind of direction. Now, nope. now this, uh, this creator has no sense of how to direct a player. Go find kerosene. Where? Eh? Storage room. Like Garage. in the field of trucks. Maybe? Uh, yes. So I should have said, there's a bunch of uh, broken down trucks out back. Check for kerosene around there. That's what he should have said, not kerosene kerosene. Jesus Christ. Kerosene barrel, that's what I'm looking for, yeah? Okay. Let's bring it to the barn door. Okay. Be careful, honey. To the barn door. Careful is my middle name. I haven't seen any aliens. They're hard to see, to be honest. It's so bloody dark and foggy. What? I can't open it from this side? Ryan! Ryan, can you hear me? What's up, bro? Huh? A pone! I can hear you! What happened? I'm not sure. I... I can't think straight. They cut me. Bad. I think I got away before they could finish. They put something in me. It's cold to the touch. 
No, I dropped the kerosene. What the fuck? Metal, maybe. Oh, okay. I'm almost at the church. Can you see it? Meet me inside. We need to talk about next steps. All right, I'll be right there. What do I need to open this? I guess I don't. I guess I can get to the church from here, but I thought I couldn't. We'll find out. The worst flashlight of all time right here. There's a little fence, but fences are huge obstructions. Oh, here you go. It's gonna open, isn't it? Right, what's going on here? Mate. What's the problem? And I looked, and behold, a stormy wind came out of the north. A great cloud with a fire enfolding itself, and the brightness round about it. And out of the mist thereof, as if it were glowing metal, out of the mist of the fire, and out of the mist thereof came the likeness of four living creatures. And this was their appearance. They had the likeness of a man, Father and Cram every Father one Cram had Ryan. four. Don't you hear that I'm preaching? Stop interrupting me! Did you see a police officer come through here? His name is Apon. And you think he can secure you from the angels of God? Father! Nah. Those aren't angels. This is an alien invasion. They abducted my son and I need to save him. Who knows what they're doing to him? Ryan, he is in God's hands. What do you think when I give that the angels take me? Your son is blessed. Huh? It begins. It begins now. <laughs> See it. Wow, through the, through the roof? Gunshots. What's in the box? What's happening? What? Oh! Oh, father! Interesting. This must be the naughty room. Oh my. This is where he goes to sin. Do I, do I really not? Hmm. God, I hate... This flashlight lasts like 10 seconds. It's abysmal. Abysmal. Huh? What does that mean? Abysmal means like extremely bad. <laughs> Was there a door here that I can't see? Push, maybe push that pole. Hopefully you can push it. Is there a key? It's hard to tell. Is it so horribly dark? Oh my god, there is a key. Jesus Christ. Uh... Right. Another key. No. What's going on here? Oh, you alright, bro? I'm here. Oh, you got one. Nice. I got a couple. Right. Glad to finally meet you. Listen, these motherfuckers, <laughs> they probed me. No. I can't help you anymore. But here's the number of the man who sent me here. Take it. They took I... my son. Do you know how to get him back? Call the number. He'll know what to do. He'll... Help you find your son. Help you stop this invasion. <laughs> He's done this before. Don't call anybody else. Not the police. Not the government. They won't help you. <clears throat> not unless you want to end up in the psych ward if you survive all this. Only trust the man on this number. Hmm. <laughs> I never thought I'd die in a goddamn graveyard. <laughs> oh, the probe's right beside him. 
And it's bloody on the other side. Oh. A bone. Oh, he just died? Don't die, goddammit. Where the fuck am I gonna find a working phone? Look at it. Ooh. They put that in his butthole, honey. Stop! They did. Honey. I don't know. I don't understand how. He's still got pants on, but he, yeah, it killed him. Worse, honey. It's what it is. Cut it no, it's fine. No bullets, no nothing. We're not gonna take anything from him. Oh! Give me oh, your you gun. gun. I'll take his clothes, too. I'll give me a few more probes. Just for good measure. Oh, it is a graveyard. It is. Cemetery. Alright, call the number. Gotta go get a phone, I guess. Because I don't carry a cell phone, because I'm a loser. Probably no cell phone service. Oh my god. Where do you want me to go, game? Just around? Nope. There's no direction in this game, man. No direction. You take his walkie? I guess I go towards the light. Maybe. Probably, yeah. There we go. This is the best. This is oh as, This direction is as good as it gets. Flashing lights to get to a little fence. I don't know. Which way should I go? Let's go this way. There's a house. Anything in the truck? Huh? Ooh. Ooh, no. Anything in the mailbox? No. <gasps> What's that? Oh yeah, the bullets are just literal bullets. Oh, a book. How the government lies and hides the truth from us. The alien deal. That's probably actually true. They will call you a conspiracy theorist guaranteed. Pick up government conspiracy book. Achievement unlocked. Oh, there's a phone here. Hello. Out of order. Wow. The phones are down. Obviously. Guess I'll have to check the telecom pedestal down the street. Wow. So I just got two more bullets. So bullets are very scarce in this game. Two bullets to shoot an alien. Down the street, he says. Is there... I mean, that direction. Down the street. In what direction, exactly? Figure it out, says the game. Good luck. Now, if I was designing a game, I would make it so that the telephone... I don't know, some sort of visual that the player sees when they exit the door shows them, oh, go here. Right, maybe it's down this way. I don't know. Bullets, bullets, bullets. A single bullet, the yeah. The darkness of this game gives me an anxiety. It is. Just like a sad place. It is weird. So there's many hiding spots, but not many aliens so far. It's like, are they going easy on me? Oh, Jesus! It's like, are they going easy on me? Oh, Jesus! Sit down. <laughs> Just as I say that. Where did he come from? Okay, do they hear the gunshots? Uh, maybe not. Okay, we need to replace those bolts I just used. That was good timing. Just, just right there. Yeah. <laughs> There's not many aliens around. Oh. My fucking face. <laughs> He's, yeah. He's like, you rang. No, I didn't mean for you to literally appear. Oh, there's one right there. I see him. But that's the car. I don't want to use too many bullets. Yeah. I don't have a way to lure them. Oh, there's a ship right there. Two alien ships right there. Cool. You want to go there and be their lord? <laughs> yes. Human lord. Yeah, yeah. I need to check every house for more bullets. God, we walk yeah, slow. Dog. Holy crap. Yeah. What the f- How did they see you? This is the cheating. Yeah, when the music's gone, maybe he doesn't see me anymore. You. Is he coming? If you 
shy your flashlight out there. Okay, I don't think he's on. coming. <laughs> yeah. Oh. What? Huh? That's a probe? I thought that was a flashlight. Yeah. Did they, you know, Bro. hit people with that? It's all bloody, yikes. No, they, 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 uh, insert it. Wow, no bullets in here. Where did he go? Wow. Wow, you're so small. You're just a child. I'm not afraid of you. Okay, the, the music stops, but he keeps coming. They are adverse to running. They're like, hmm, this is only worth minimal effort. Scary, honey. Is he still following you? Maybe. Yes, yes. I'll blast him if he comes in, honey. I hear him clickety clackety. Oh, bullet! Yeah. They're coming. I think they're coming. No, oh, he's scanning. That's their scanner. We heard that when they were in a house before. Oh, yeah. I forgot. <laughs> there he is. You Crouch! Little... I don't think they can see in the windows. Well. Okay, we checked both those houses. Check this house. <laughs> Looks like something over there. Zant. Oh, is this the one I... Oh, I hear somebody. What? Te Teleco bed is still out of hmm. order. And the circuit board is broken. Where the hell am I going to find one of those? Wow. If that doesn't sum up the game, I don't know what else does. Where the hell am I going to find one of those? No direction at all. Nothing. Figure it out, says the game. Maybe check, uh, I don't know, the next flashing... Yeah, I'll go towards the next light source, I guess. Lights or lantern. Shit! Lights or lantern. Shit! Out of nowhere! It's black and you know, shadowing, following you. How do you take a headshot? Was oh, that a circuit board? <laughs> hey, this actually might work. Convenient. Hey, this exact thing I need might do the trick. I can only kill two more aliens. Finish this game, honey. Finish it. We are working on it. There. That should about do it. Now time to call this mystery man. Call the call now. I have to go back to that phone. Prepare the telecom. There was one more alien around here somewhere. Keep your eyes peeled. Keep... Well, oh, there he is. They just kind of, you know, appear. I saw him. Don't know when they come. Oh, he saw me, but there's no music. Wow. Bruh. Just like that, and they see you. The thing they don't like running. I don't remember what house it was. Which house has the phone? Is he still coming? No. Wow, I'm tired, you loser. Uh, uh. Yeah, maybe it's this one. Yes. All right. Hello? Who's it gonna be? God damn it. Please pick up the phone. Yeah. <laughs> uh, hey, my name's Ryan. I'm calling from Grey Hill. Your friend Depone gave me this number. He. He's dead. I'm. I'm sorry. 
He told me that he came too late and that I should call this number. A pawn is dead? Ryan, did he tell you about using tinfoil? And if so, do you have enough? Yeah, I got it. Listen, they took my son. He's on board one of those fucking ships. A pawn said you can help me. Yeah, I can. Now listen to me and do what I tell you. Wrap your entire body in the tinfoil. Completely cover yourself head to toe and let them abduct you. I know this sounds crazy, but if you want your son back, you have to try. Won't they just me. take that off? Uh, no, he's wearing all this tinfoil. Let's just leave it on. Yes. Terrible uh, idea. What the? F me. Who exactly are you? And how do you know this works? Wow. Well, this is how Fuck. scammers got you, honey. This is the most <laughs> stupid thing I've Trust ever done. Me. I know how those work. All right, that's it. God, I look like an idiot. But the plane? Are they leaving without me? Got the plane working. But the guy in the phone said this plane won't work. I have to warn them. Guess I don't care about that. Amy, can you hear me? Matt, Matt, can you hear me? Oh, oh, fuck. Me. I'll try it again later. Where's the plane? I don't hear them anymore. Find a way onto the field. Well, I, I could just step right over this uh, little fence here, but <laughs> but uh, now. Nah. Why? Find a way a onto fence. the field. A different fence, honey. Oh, there's a flashing light. I want you to slice. Yeah, you have to go to my specific, <laughs> specific fence. Okay, now what? Uh, what? Jesus oh, Christ. Mu multiple. It's a goddamn UFO parking lot out here. <laughs> I'm gonna have to go around them. I mean, yeah, we have to because there's a fence. I don't even want to use my flashlight because it's so bad. Yeah. It doesn't even help. It's nothing. Just, um, hop on. Go to the next flashing light because we can't direct you otherwise. Ryan! Ryan! Can you hear me? <laughs> hey, is everything okay? Yeah, I'm good. But something is wrong with Amy and Matt. They started the biplane to rescue Henry, but I don't know where they are, and I can't hear the plane anymore. They might have been taken by those things. Hey, where are you? What's your plan? I'm pretty close to Brandon's house. This detour took way longer than expected. I hope he's okay. <gasps> I don't have time to explain everything, but this cop I met, they got him. He's dead. Death by probing. Oh my god. No. He was Ryan. sent to warn us by a mysterious man. <laughs> the timing of I it. Contacted. Who quotes. And he told me the only way to rescue Henry is to dress up in tinfoil and let them abduct me. I know, I know. It sounds crazy, but if it's the only shot I have to get Henry back, I have to try. Yes! That could work! Well, at least to avoid them going into your brain. I'll guide you once you're in it. <laughs> Sounds good. Oh. Make sure you get your van up and running. Once I get Henry, we'll drive out and meet with the mysterious man. He can help us figure this all out. What? Wait, Bob. That... That sounds like Amy's walkie. That's Amy! Amy! Amy, are you there? Where? Amy! I can't hear you! Can you hear me? Where's this coming from? Henry! There's a light I'm here, coming so. for you! God damn it! No. Fuck! No! Please, no! God! You bastard! I think it's just all my raid walkie talkie. <laughs> you! What the fuck are they doing to him? They think they're all on the same ship. What in the hell should I do now? Come on, don't make this game look like a dirty game. This is Mr. LaFletch's house. LaFletch. What was his name again? 
Matthew, are you here? Oh, it was a dead alien right there. Nice. Oh, is, and there's a dirty probe. Okay. All right. Why did I have an outhouse outside their own house? Keep going forward. Okay. What's that? That was Brandon's kid. She's still in the house. How do you recognize that as a kid? I thought that was like a cow or something. I don't see anything. <laughs> He's like, a... okay, this is probably the right house. Mm, nice. Oh, dead aliens. Nice. It's locked. Is this not the right house? You? The lantern there. For need no to find something to break this door. Really? Not my my bat won't do it. All right. Find something. Like a crowbar? Oh, there's aliens on the roof, too. Bunch of fire extinguishers. Why are there so many fire extinguishers? An alcohol. Wrecking aliens here. What the? What's... Stop them from getting in the window, I guess. Mm. Oh, Trish. hey. Rachel. Ryan. Um, what are you wearing? Oh man, I'm so glad they didn't get you. Uh -huh. I was hiding under my bed, but they got Daddy. Uh, yeah, I know. My dad says the government is lying about everything. Well, he's right. But don't worry, though. I'll protect you. I have to get on that saucer to save him, so I'll bring you to Bob, okay? He can watch after you until I come you back with your dad. You can't protect me? My dad says you're a weakling. Wow. And you can't protect anybody. Wow. He said you couldn't even save your own marriage. Mm-hmm. <laughs> uh, mm -hmm. Keep talking. Well, I know he's your dad, but... Don't believe everything he says. And besides, I killed a few of those aliens on the way over here. Yeah. And your dad's the one stuck on the ship. I got an itchy finger right about now. What? Where is your son? Where is Henry? <sighs> they got him too. Ryan, that sounds like a car. What? They must be driving through town stopping for gas or something. Okay. Hey, what? um, you weren't in Vietnam like my dad was, right? Uh, no. Well, can you check the window? What? What window? God bless you. Huh? Rachel, no! Where are you going? Stay! Oh. Uh, or what the fuck is going on with this kid? I already got the key. What the hell is Brandon teaching his daughter? So because I wasn't in Vietnam, she ditched me? What? Or something like that? Vietnam victory. The story of a couple young Americans, including Brandon Hartman, who beated a whole horde of Viet Cong. Sounds like a... Uh, 
A lie? Wow. What's up with all the collectibles? No bullets or nothing? Wow. Oh, there's two there. God. The way you collect bullets is too obscure. Alright. That was a waste of time. Where'd you go? This way? We heard somebody... A car. This way? Gosh, I can't wait for this game to finish. <laughs> no. They got him. Rachel! <laughs> Was that the girl that you just ran away? It, I don't Draco! care about you. Yeah, get her. Uh, stupid kid. Corn in the cornfield. A corn that doesn't move. <laughs> Wasn't in the budget. Huh? Huh? Max! Is that you? Where are you, boy? Where are you? Snot-nosed brat. Uh-oh, I hit a fence. Well, that's that. What you gonna do? What you gonna do with the fence, hmm? I don't know. The fence is my Achilles heel. I can't get over them. <laughs> I was born without knees. <laughs> I can't actually lift my leg up. Seriously, though? You had me chase a voice? And then you make me run into a dead end? God, the direction in this game is 0 out of 10. And the voice just stops. Okay, was I supposed to go to a specific part of this field? So my dog was barking. Am I supposed to find my dog? There is no map. Uh. Wow. What the hell? So we went in a circle? What am I hearing now? I don't want the idea of like just trees just all over my face. Oh, this is what it wanted me to find. Oh my god, you wanted me to find our doll. Let them take me! Oh, Rachel! She's still here. Where? Oh! Ah! What the f oh, they abducted you. That's what you want. But I, I want to be abducted. Oh no! You got abducted! But not the way that you wanted to. No, not really. Okay. Gonna find her dumb doll again. Oh, driven again, Jesus. Okay, it was by the big thing. <laughs> That's not where her voice comes from, though. Here, where? I think I have to go to the voice of voices until it spawns the teddy bear. Oh, here. And then back where we came from. Don't be rude. Yeah, now there's a flashlight. Alright. That is it! Let them take me! Oh, Rachel! She's still here! Where are you, kid? Seriously? The way these fences work. Are you in here, you little snot nose? Oh, the car's gone. How about that? Rachel! Oh. What the hell? Looks like the light from the shed. Ryan! Ryan, are you here? Ryan! Yes. Yeah. Come on, we can go oh, over the same time. I can't. Well, I was out working on the caravan. 
Yeah, after taking a photo shoot, I asked him if they wanted to have some coke, but... Bob, it's okay. All good. I got it. Just joking! I imprisoned one in the bedroom, and I put a tinfoil hat on him. I'm gonna make some experiments. But I won't probe him. Bob, I swear. please stop. Uh, maybe sell him on the black market. We got market. Brandon's daughter, so I'm a little busy. Uh, what okay. do you need? I found a solution to make the caravan work. It'll take me a few minutes to oh, get it done. Bob, that's great. That's what I needed to hear. It'll be our chance to get out of this town. I have to save Rachel first. She's trapped in the barn by the gas station. I'm going to get her, then we can make a plan to save Henry. Yes, Ryan. We have to be fast with Henry. God, I hope they didn't start drilling into his teeth. Bob, can <laughs> you not say shit like that? <laughs> I don't even want to think about it. I heard Brandon causing trouble for them on the saucer through Amy's walking. I think they're all on the same Ooh, shit. good. Okie doke, bye Ryan. Jesus Christ. Can I open it? Yeah. It wouldn't let me open it until now. Right. Two aliens I can kill. What is, oh, there's one up there. Oh, and there. Uh, I don't want to kill both of you. Can I lose them? I'm going to run out of stamina pretty soon here. He's still following you. Oh, he's he stopped. How oh, they give up pretty easily? Interesting. What's that? Oh, it's just a reflection. Rachel is in there. Why the hell did they use a bike chain to lock the gate? It's crazy. I'm gonna have to find some bolt cutters or something to get through there. What? Where? Where? Oh. <laughs> Why is that red? Oh, he's scanning. Find some bolt cutters. Yeah, are there are two aliens here. I think so. Where's the bolt cutters? Something flashing green. No? I saw no. I saw something flashing red, but that was his scanner, an alien scanner. Yeah. Wish I could like ambush them. Cause I do have a baseball bat. Ah. Jesus Christ. Uh, handy. All right, bolt cutters acquired. I cannot run very long. All right, was in the shed. Found the kid, I guess. Oh, Rachel, I'm here. Huh? Whoa! Ah! Me if you want that to clearly hit me. Uh, <laughs> I've always wanted to see. Glad that. you're here, and the caravan's working. I'm gonna put Rachel in your bedroom. She needs rest. Uh, Bob, seriously. Oh. No. You imprisoned an alien. I, I told you I did it, dude. Just lay around the carpet. But again, I didn't probe him. Didn't probe him. Just put a tinfoil hat on him. Lay her on the carpet? So funny, Bob. 
I think he's one of their dentists, not one of their butt drillers. That doesn't sound good, Bob. I'll go out and try and get its attention. I need to get it to abduct me. It's my only shot at getting Henry back. Drive to Nevada and take Rachel with you. I think that's where our mysterious friend is. I'm gonna work with your mysterious friend together, Brian, to bring all this to the public. Okay. All right. His number is 555-0199. Call him as soon as possible. And Bob, all right, I gotta go. Thank you. Stay safe. Hey, uh, Ryan, you know, you were the only one who didn't think I was crazy. Thanks for that, man. I love you. All right. Good story, bro. Wait, where's my gun and everything? What do I do now? Get abducted? I hear you. Come and get me, yo son of a bitch. Yeah. I take me. They're taking me, honey. The dialogue in this game is rough. <laughs> The fact that they talk over each other and the dialogue is just... Dull. Is it working? Henry? Henry? Can't see anything? It doesn't end there. All right, see ya. That was the tinfoil a total lie? Oh my god, this is the ending, isn't it? We don't even see if he saves his son. That's yep, things seem to have worked out pretty good for Rachel and me. I hate that we don't know what happened on the UFO. To Ryan and the others, but... Wow. Well, after Ryan was abducted, his dog Max came along, and together we're now on our way to meet this mysterious man. Who are you talking to? I mean, that was the Greyhill incident. Time for a new book, yeah? God, I hope I'll find a publisher this time. This is literally the developer talking. Rambling again. Well, I hope you folks enjoyed yourself. Catch you on later down the road. Bro, you didn't even finish your game. Hey, Rachel, what was your favorite part about the story of Grey Hill? Uh, Bob? Who are you just talking to? Bro didn't even finish his game and at the end he makes this little cut scene where the character is clearly speaking through the developer or no the developer is clearly speaking through the, the character and saying well I wish we knew what happened but that was the Grey Hill incident and if you want to know what happens I need to make another game but I hope I find a publisher this time but that's such a lie like our character's journey to save his son was clearly part of the Grey Hill incident and not a separate game. A separate game would have been after we resolved it and saved our son or failed or whatever and stopped the aliens. Maybe a new alien invasion starts, an even worse one. That would be a sequel. This is literally and obviously an unfinished game. And I gotta give a 0 out of 10 for that. That is abysmal. Abysmal garbage. The game was really meh. The dialogue was terrible. Story was terrible. Graphics were okay. But little, definitely, he didn't uh, even try to balance it in terms of what light and dark. The flashlight was awful. There's only one enemy type, but they changed size. They're not that threatening. When you, like, a few decent jump scares when the aliens are there. But everything else being so poor. 
overall made this one of the worst games in recent memory. But the biggest insult, like, I could have been okay with it all had it been a finished game and we had a conclusion. Like, at least we p finished a game. It's not even finished. And he's charging full price for this game. Uh, I didn't even know that it was unfinished. Had I known this was an unfinished game, we wouldn't have even touched it. So shame on you, developer. Shame on you. Finish your damn game next time and uh, don't push it out. That was a cop-out. And honestly... You're a lazy bitch for doing that. What the hell are you thinking? Anyway. Uh, at least we had a couple laughs or moments out of it, I guess. Uh, we're probably going to blacklist this developer. We'll see. But uh, yeah, hope you guys got some enjoyment out of that. And we'll see you in the next video. As always, thanks for watching.